Hi guys, I'm Chris from Haltech USA, and today I'm excited to share with you the new HC5 Hydraulic Crimper. The HC5 Hydraulic Crimping Tool is the ideal solution for crimping amp phenol connectors like those packaged with the Haltech Nexus R5 VCU. It provides up to five tons of force and can precisely crimp a variety of cables, like battery and welding cables, as well as terminal lugs. Let's open up the moldy carrying case to see what comes with the kit. All right, so inside we find the tool itself, which features a nice durable black oxide finish. That's going to be a rugged solution that will help prevent marring when in use or swapping the dies. We also find eight electroplated crimping dies. Haltech provides sizes ranging from four to 70 millimeters squared. Now, don't worry if you don't know which size you need for your cable or wire because the quick start guide will actually have a handy reference table to figure out what size die you'll need. Finally, there is a rebuild kit included, which means you don't need to replace the crimping tool when it comes time to service the hydraulic piston. To replace a die set, release the jaws by rotating this return valve to the off position. This retracts the hydraulic piston and opens the jaws. Once open, simply pull the die and it will release from its mount. Insert your new die set. And then close the jaws by rotating the valve to the on position. Then you work the pumping handle to close the gap. You get the idea. Let's look at the Amphenol connectors on the Haltech Nexus R5. These are used for the main power and ground for the PDM functionality. Using the selection chart in the quick start guide, we'll see that a 50 millimeter squared die set is needed to crimp the one gauge wire. So let's go ahead and install that die set onto our crimper. We're going to release the valve and let the jaws open, remove the set that's currently installed, find the 50 millimeter squared die set and install those. We're gonna take our stripping tool of choice and remove three quarters inch of sheathing from the cable. Now we need to disassemble our connector by removing the back shell and seal. Now we're gonna slide that onto our cable now we're going to insert the head of our connector into our crimping tool, positioning the ferrule between the crimping dies. You can rotate the valve to the on position and tighten the jaws to lightly grip the ferrule. Insert our exposed cable into the ferrule. With the ferrule secured and the cable inserted, it's time to crimp. Slowly squeeze the pump handle to crimp the ferrule and cable together. Be sure not to over crimp as letting the dies push against each other can damage the die set and the crimping head. Now we need to pull the seal over the ferrule and finally install the back shell by tightening it onto the connector head. And done. Once you're finished, store your HC5 crimper and die sets in its carry case in a clean, dry location. All right, there we have it. The new HC5 crimping tool is a simple and easy to use hydraulic crimper that makes assembling amphenol connectors easier than ever. It's now available on our website, and if you have any questions, feel free to drop a comment below or reach out to our awesome tech support team at haltech.com.